Well, early Sunday morning, about 10.30, I was playing a video game with my little brother when I heard a big boom. Uh, at first, I really didn't think nothing of it. I thought something just had failed, but then I, I heard a, another boom, and I immediately jumped up and ran outside, and I seen that it was a car like on my front porch, basically. So I immediately thought that, you know, somebody, the car was gonna catch on fire. So I ran out, and I was trying to move as quickly as I can to get the, the mother out and her son out. I heard her son first. I heard him screaming. So I seen that the lady was having a seizure. So I got her out. I had to pull her tongue out of her mouth and put, lay her on her side. And then me and my neighbor, we went to go get the little boy. We had to untwist his leg and pull him out. He seemed to be fine. He, he let me know his name. He let me know how old he was. And the only thing, he, he was just scared. And all day I was going back and forth like, oh my gosh, I need to know if they're okay. I need to know if they're okay. And then I finally got, got word from Tarika Boone that, that she was okay, that they were in stable condition, that they were fine, that they were recovering. The young boy went home and I was just, it's just a blessing to hear that they're okay. I can't, I can't say nothing was going through my mind. I just knew I had to, to get them out before the car had caught on fire. I just thought the car was gonna catch on fire. So I yelled to my little brother to call the police and to get my little uh, sister out the house. So they did that and we, I just tried to get them out as quickly as possible. I really didn't think too much of it. I was just, it was all happening so fast. I just went off instinct. I talked to the husband yesterday. He's a real nice guy. He was just telling me, giving me praises, thanking me and everything. And he gave me more information on the injuries. Um, the, the mother uh, broke her um, femur bone into two places and the son broke his uh, shin bone. But other than that, they, they were okay. And I, he was just glad that I was here and I actually knew what to do. I took an EMT class this school year earlier than in the year. It's for, I played a major in criminal justice and I needed that for um, you know a stepping stone into my major. So I took that class and that class was helpful a lot. It helped me with everything. I um, immediately learning everything, paying attention every day, going to Maryville to the classes because I had football practice and I couldn't stay after school. So going to Maryville and it was like they showed us how what to do when somebody's having a seizure, what not to do, everything. And I and I instantly knew from her facial expression that she was having a seizure.